Community members are honoring Officer Romrell from blue ribbons around the city to flags at the police station. They want his family to know they are thankful for his service. ABC4's Rosie Nguyen joins us live from South Salt Lake with how he is being memorialized. Rosie? Rick, the sun may be shining here in South Salt Lake, but the mood is very somber. Here at the South Salt Lake Police Station, the entire road here on Main Street is lined with American flags to honor and memorialize Officer Rombrell. We spoke to a woman who is married to an officer who worked with Rombrell. She says putting up these blue ribbons here that you see is the least that she can do. For these wives of South Salt Lake police officers, they know each day is a risk. Once their husbands leave for work, they hope and pray they never get the call their loved one won't be coming home. Last night, the news of Officer David Romrell's death shook Laura Letham and her fellow sisters with police wives of Utah. It's your family. It, these ladies are my sisters. They're just like my sister, if it was my own sister who lost their spouse. Rombrell is the first officer killed in the line of duty for the South Salt Lake Police Department. He was a former Marine who served multiple tours and started his career with South Salt Lake Police just under a year ago. Immediately, Letham and her group came together this morning to put up blue ribbons around South Salt Lake to let Officer Rombrell's wife Elizabeth know they're here for her. For us... It's something we can do. Right now, there's only so much we can do at the moment, but this is something we can do. We can, tribute, can pay tribute to him, we can honor him, and we can honor her, his family. It may seem small to some, but it's powerful. And even though Officer Romrell leaves behind his wife and four-month-old baby, Lethem says the community will make sure they're taken care of. Their family, it is your family. It's a tight-knit community, and you mourn together, you have cheer together when good things happen, you lift each other when you need help. Now already there are two GoFundMe pages to raise money for Officer Romrell's family. For the link to those fundraisers, head over to our website at abc4.com. Reporting live in South Salt Lake, Rosie Nguyen, ABC4 News. Thank you, Rosie. Be sure to stay with ABC4 News for all of the latest developments on Officer David Romrell's death, reaction, and the investigation. We will have details of his funeral when they are announced, both on air and online at abc4.com.